it's very difficult, but it's also uh, fulfilling. You know, it's a big challenge, especially like in Norwich. You know, being a single dad, being a, a black man, single dad, I always stand out. If you know me, you know. So it's been a big challenge, but I think I've gone past the hard bit now because my little girl is going to school in September. Yeah. So I looked after her when she was four months. And that was that time. Oh, there's lots of challenges. I mean, things like um, changing facilities. You know, in some places, changing facilities are in women toilet. Um, so I find it hard. If like if I wanted to change my little girl, you know, I couldn't take her into male toilets. Also, I couldn't take her into women toilets. So those are like kind of challenges that I met. You know. And you just people curious why I am a single dad. You know. I think it's not common. People still find it a bit hard to accept. You know, but I can see some changes, you know, from this time that I started being a single dad up to now. I can certainly see a change. And there's more help now than probably when I started. If if I was to meet someone, you know, I find it hard to keep them away from my child. Whereas a single mom can stop can like um, stop someone getting attached to their kids. I couldn't do it that way. For a man it's hard because once I try to stop them, then they'll think, um, you don't love me, you don't want me to be closer to your kid. So just those challenges. Right? Like I said, if it wasn't for MEP, I wouldn't have known other things. You know? They've put me in touch with so many. There's so many groups out there that can help people, that can help single dads. You know? It's just a matter of letting people know there is help.